Alright guys, we're back with Dynasty Warriors 8. Uh, obviously this is going to be Imperial Escort, and I haven't set the weapons up or anything. So I'm going to go with this guy. Uh, I guess his name is Zhu Huang or something. I'll probably get told it's not that immediately, but you know. So he is the guy with a giant axe, which is kind of similar to Dian Wei, honestly. Uh, it's pretty similar. I'm just looking at attack here. They don't vary it that much. Uh, yeah, so there is a, I think, is it just called Axe? Uh, okay, so his is called Great Axe and Dian Wei's is just called Axe. Um, where is that, by the way? I may as well use it, I guess. So they're, they're very similar, uh, but his is pretty much more awesome and we'll get to why that is pretty much as soon as we start. Because uh, <laughs> his Axe can grapple. I don't know how that works, but uh, I will show you. So uh, yeah, let's go. There is no truer path than that of the warrior. No, I believe there should be a cutscene here, if I'm not mistaken. So I'll probably shut up for that. Huh. Got our set now. There, don't let them escape. They're quite ahead. Why can't they just leave us alone? If the noble Yuan Shao has the Emperor under his control, we will use his name to make a move. But he does not have what it takes to quell the chaos. Gain the authority of the Emperor. Rally my forces. Create a new order. That is my path, and the path to ruling this land. They're coming from the front, too! Come. The road ahead must be kept safe. We ride straight to Shukan. Ha! Yeah! Ha! Wipe out any enemies who stand in our way. Alright, so this guy is awesome and you'll see. He he just picks up people and throws them with his axe. I mean, you can't get more awesome than that. Especially since it's so oversized as well, I just can't take it seriously. Plus it's pretty awesome, the uh, moveset honestly, um, as well. I'm just taking out this guy first. There we go. Alright, so it's pretty beefy, but uh, I think we just need to kind of keep this wagon under control. Alright, so let's get the first Muso out there. I don't think this guy will be used very often as well, so that's why I picked him. I believe Lee Dian is still used quite, quite until quite late on, so yeah. I mean, just Jesus, man. Alright, so it is two. Uh, two squares and two triangles. I didn't, I'm not going to try it for it right now. There we go. Just tossing him with the axe. Because why not? Alright, so I don't know if we need to kill all these guys. I think we just need to kill the generals for now. Alright, that should do it. And he will actually get attack up as well. Which is uh, pretty insane. Seriously, I just... How beefy. Alright, so, some other guys from the other side, okay. Alright, so the other axe is the Unway's axe, uh, of course that gets a bonus as well. You can see it's not as big, but uh, whatever. He used to have uh, dual axes like um, Zhang Liao has now, but they, they took that away from him. I, I don't know. I can't remember what Zhang Liao's weapon used to be. So they kind of sw they kind of swap stuff up occasionally. That, that moves pretty awesome as well. Yeah, I can't get in there. Luckily, they put the uh, bonuses at the side there. We'll get back. Just calm down. Right. So I believe we need to get back there. Is they're actually th they're actually bringing it back to the start. 
I, I, I can't remember if you're just meant to uh, let that happen or if you're actually meant to uh, try and stop that, but uh, whatever. Alright, so you should have a faster horse as well, slightly. Okay, so apparently I need to uh, make sure it doesn't go back there. Okay. Alright, so apparently I, I, I played it before that uh, I, did, I, I did this as well. And I didn't really know what I was doing. So yeah, I'm pretty sure this is just meant to happen. Seriously, that move set is insane. One of my favorite, I guess, not my favorite character in terms of personality, but pretty, pretty cool looking dude, honestly. All right, so I can't remember if I'm meant to stay here, but I'm just gonna try and get this to move now. I don't know if I just need to go ahead or what. Come on. I'm pretty sure I've got to wait for it. They should be moving now, as I can see. Yep. Alright. I'm just going to follow them. Okay, so I'm going to... Okay, you're going down that way. I may as well just follow it completely. Since the map is relatively small, it shouldn't take that long to actually go through it. Generally, I, I like the map times on, on this game because they, they generally don't take that much longer than 20 minutes or such. So they're always quite, quite small, which is a good thing, I think. It's not like Age of Empires where I've got to sit there for an hour and try to uh, finish a scenario because I want to do them in one sitting pretty much all the time. Some of them last longer than that. Boulders, alright! Well, I'm gonna go through here then. Well, those boulders kind of failed, I guess. Boulders are always a real pain. They must have used this path to get up there. Apparently everyone is weak to this weapon right now. I don't know why that is, but... Oh, Jesus. He took that one to the face and didn't even flinch. Well, badass, man. Is there another one coming? Alright, that'll do for you. Hey, it's the, it's Mask Guy, he's back! Alright, so maybe we should... Uh, okay, you can switch in the middle of an attack? That's pretty cool. So, yeah. I actually really like the axes in this game as compared to the spears. Like, <laughs> you could fire a moment, it's like axes are always getting the shaft. In this game, they're actually pretty decent compared to spears, which... Well, there are some good ones, but uh, generally they, they only attack in front of them, which is not a good thing. Uh, obviously. Because <laughs> you want to hit everywhere around you. I mean, they, they still kind of hit everywhere around you in this, but at least they slash. You know, they hit everyone in front of you, not behind you. Which is pretty helpful. Blue Boo! I thought we weren't going to see him for a while. God damn it. Alright, so I'm gonna imagine that this carriage is coming up. It looks like it is on the map. We're probably gonna get stopped again. In fact, I already know we're gonna. I didn't... It's for some reason, it always puts you into this mode as you get to... Uh, with, by that, I mean with the mini-map. Uh, like, I'm not gonna press anything, just go in here, and it should... Yeah, it changes the mini-map for some reason. I think it's so that uh, you can't see... Yeah, I think it's so you can't see most of the uh, the surrounding generals coming at you. Even though you can kind of see their names from far away because of the uh, the name tags, but uh, whatever. What? Does it look like I'm having trouble? Nah, it's just my secret plan to throw the enemy off. I'm sure it is. No homo, man. <laughs> Jesus. The Bosch. Why? It looks like we're still fighting yellow turbans, by the way. I don't really know why, but uh, okay. Yeah, you suck. Okay. Is that all? Very good. I, shall I doubt it. 
Who are they looking for right now? I don't actually know. Thing is, you can kind of alt tab here and see where the uh, where the generals are. So I don't know why they did this uh, mini map thing anyway. <laughs> because you can just uh, you can just uh, pause, and it will show you the map, obviously. Okay, are we just? Oh, it's because we're meant to find them. Okay. Can I just go like uh, battlefield? No, it does not display a mirror. They are smart. Okay. So I believe he's just up here then. Uh, I don't actually know. We'll check at least. Or is that just the point I'm meant to get him to? I guess that's just the end point right there. Okay, we gotta go looking for him. Which is annoying. Okay, garage. I I can't really remember specifics, but I think it's over at um, the side across over here. I'm probably going to be wrong though. There he is. Okay, I probably should have seen him before actually. And they're going to spawn in. Well, I've actually found you already. Come on. There's no one even here. Fucking hell, Lubu! Get over here. Are we just meant to take him to the end here, I guess? Alright, where's Lubu? He's fucking miles away, whatever. So, I think I just need to take him to this end point. Or not? Okay. And once again, this guy is weak here, so let's go and get this attack off. He's gonna do it. It's it is Jang Jang He as well. All right, and that'll do. And that is the end of this one. Not that difficult from what I could see. Uh, now, I believe there wasn't any optional object- oh, sorry. I know what you are thinking, your highness. You think me a disrespectful and disloyal dog of the same breed as Dong Zhuo. I understand why, of course. Am I wrong? You pretend to respect me, but you are driven by ambition. I know your kind too well. Yes. Indeed. I admit I am an ambitious man. Our desires drive us. Our hearts drive us forward. Uncontrolled. This leads to chaos. The current state of the land is a testament to this. I believe that we are capable of better. Desires can be controlled. Strength ruled with reason. Order can be restored. And now, I have a chance to realize this ambition. You wish to control the land? With strength and reason? Exactly. And, at the pinnacle of such a world, I require a true symbol of power and reason. 
I will need you, your highness. Rather than hoping vainly for peace, I may indeed be wiser to follow your plan. Well then, Cao Cao, as my minister, restore order to the land. As you command. And there we go. Alright, so I, I didn't... I knew there was a cutscene at some point during the scenario, but uh, whatever. Okay. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, the Emperor is basically on Cao Cao's side. That's what I get from this. Though, I can't remember if he actually remains that. I believe it's had something to do after um, Cao P comes into um, power. Something like that, eventually. Alright, so I believe Yuan Shao is going to be the next guy that is taken on. Or not? Maybe maybe not? I don't know. I can't really remember. Or no, we're just going to attack some random guy. Alright! I like how many generic guys we attack at the beginning of, uh, <laughs> of the beginning of the campaigns, but at least we're taking out some guys, like Jang He and such. Ah, I remember this one, I think. In Dian Wei as well, I think. As I recall. Yep, okay. Uh, yep, this is going to be a, the next one. It's just Dian Wei and Cao Cao, both of which I've already played, unfortunately, otherwise I've played Dian Wei. So, I guess I'll go DM way, because I like axes better, I don't know. So, I'll see you guys next time on Dynasty Warriors 8.